I'm with MRSA. She's in charge. She's got all the money. And oh, where is Luis? Oh, there's Luis. We're also with Luis. He, we're, he's our ground crew here in Nicaragua. He is a medical student and he kind of volunteers dash works with Global Solidarity. And this is MRSA's husband, Ali. This is where our team is picking up rice, beans, sugar, and oil. It's a very, very busy place. Okay, right now we're just figuring out exactly how much we can buy with our budget. We have almost 57,000 Cordobas. Okay, we're making the transaction. Marissa's got the big stack of cash on her. Let's see the cash. That is the cash donated, you guys. <laughs> the deal is they work out what they need here and then she pays at the tell here and then we're going to go pick the stuff up somewhere else. Okay, Yeso's got one of the bags and we're starting to load up the carts. Those bags look pretty heavy. Alright, and here's where they go. Oh, Mercer's got, what is that? <laughs> I'm not sure. And the food keeps coming. Oh, Luis got himself one too. It's quite a long trail that we have to walk from the grocery store to where we parked. And it's very hot out here. These guys are doing a great job. I, on the other hand, am not being very helpful, but I am documenting all of this for you. So now, Mursa is grabbing some plastic bags because all of that stuff that we bought now has to be packaged for individual distribution. So while the men are doing the difficult job of getting all the food over here, um, I'm just being a weenie and sitting in the shade and eating fruit. Here is the food we have so far. It's starting to pile up. <laughs> Buying like 200 food hampers or 100 food hampers wherever we're at now is a lot harder in Nicaragua than it is in Canada. Like in Canada we just pull a big delivery van up to one store and load her up. It's a lot different here. In fact once we get all this loaded up we are putting them on bicycle taxis and pedaling them down to the dump which will be about a 30 minute pedal. <laughs> So the guys are doing multiple loads. They've got this huge pile and they load it up in their little bike taxis and then they take it out to the dump. This is like an all day event. <laughs>